stretch of that game for you guys? Yeah, I mean, um, we, we got out to a pretty decent 20-point lead, um, and then they started hitting shots in that in the you know midway through to the end of the third, and crowd got involved. They started getting confidence, feeling good about themselves, and um, they came all the way back, got in front. But I think um, our guys, you know, showed great, you know, mental toughness throughout those stretches to, to not fold. Uh, I thought the way we responded, um, started getting stops, getting good looks offensively, um, kind of flipped the game back in our way, uh, our momentum our way, um, kind of, you know, got, got the game back on the right, you know, path for us. So um, teams are going to make runs. Obviously, you don't want to give up a 20-point lead. You don't want to get down 20 points. But, um, you know, the NBA players, they're talented. They can make runs. And I thought we uh, weathered the storm well, you know, when they got the deficit back. You guys have seen a lot of adversity runs of this sort throughout the season. What is it about this group that has such uncommon poise and, and immaturity about them? Yeah, we don't flinch. We, we understand um, we can be on either side of it. Um, as I said, you know, it's the NBA. Guys can make shots any given night. And um, tonight we started hot. We got out to a 20-point lead. Then they got hot. And um, it can be like that every night night and um, you just got to be able to um, stay level-headed through you know a swing either way and uh, we did that tonight you know their crowd got loud got involved and I thought we we did a really good job you know start that fourth going forward um, to really kind of get them get them out of the game and um, and and make them take tough shots make them guard multiple actions um, and you know guys may be plays down the stretch and we're able to close it out. Josh obviously we've we've talked in recent weeks just about you know the staff using you in different ways and, and, you know, what that's maybe done for the team, for you. But these past couple games, especially, it, it seems like you've been in a different groove. You know, maybe the, the push shots that you were shooting earlier in the year are, are falling. You're, you're shooting threes at a you know quicker trigger. Just has there been a, a surge in confidence for you? Definitely. I mean, anytime any player sees the ball go in the rim, you start to get confidence and the rim starts to become bigger and um, and those shots start to feel easier. But um, as I say, the same way a team's going to run up, you know, shots don't always – you know, four, they don't, they don't always miss. So um, just, just taking the right ones, I mean, um, you know, seeing different looks, bigs got to me, guards got to me, um, just, just trying to take what the defense gives. And, um, yeah, just keep shooting with confidence. You know, my guys trust me, coaches trust me to, to step out there and, and, and shoot them. And